It just has a little bit of zirconium in its upper atmosphere, which make, makes it uh, look a little bit different and gives it a little bit of a different color. There's quite a lot of various carbon stars that have um, a variety of different colors depending on the materials in their upper atmosphere. But in this particular case, it's actually zirconium that's the most prevalent. And within the next thousand or so years, this zirconium will very likely sink to the bottom of the star, or not to the bottom, but basically will sink below the upper atmosphere and something else will come out and possibly change its color until eventually this will become a typical regular white dwarf, a star that essentially 